Hey besties, so today I have a clothing haul for you. Fun one. Basically, this is just a spring haul, um, but it's kind of a lot of things. I have clothes from Princess Polly, Zara, and then also like clothes from thrifting. And then um, I'm gonna do a thrift flip video soon with all those clothes. There's a lot of things I need to sew. Um, yeah, so let's just get into the video. Also, I'm really tired. So, let's do Zara first. So, the first thing I got at Zara is this tank top. It's really cute. It's like this blue. It's kind of like blue and white. I don't know. It's kind of showing up weird on the camera. But it's like a blue and white pattern. And, yeah, it's really pretty. So, that was the first thing I got. Just fun. Easy for the summer. The second thing I got is this tank top. It's a high neck pink one, really cute. So yeah, it's like this pink color, really pretty. It's kind of ribbed, I don't know if you can see, but yeah. Then I got two pairs of jean shorts. They're the same ones, just different colors. So I got these ones, which I like. They're kind of light wash. I need some dark wash um, jean shorts now, but yeah. But they're really cute. I really like the distressing on them and they're really good length. They like, I don't know, they're they're really nice. I really like them. So yeah, so I got it in that color and then I got it in this like kind of faded black color, which I thought would look kind of tacky, but I actually really like it like a lot. So that's good. Okay, what are we on? Fifth thing I got from Zara is this top. I think it's so cute. Oh my gosh. I love it. Um, I got all this stuff in store by the way, so my Instagram page is just like Zara Reels. It's like a spring haul from Zara, spring, like literally it's all that. But the thing is, I didn't really get any of this stuff on my Reels. The tank tops probably were, but like I really wanted the like knitted shorts, I'll put them here. I might still like buy them online because I they were online. Um, okay, back to this top. So it's just kind of like a beach top. It's just like a, I don't know, like a beach top. Like I wear it over a swimsuit at the beach and everything. I mean like, yeah, it's just kind of like a beach top to throw on, on top or if I'm going to like the river or something. Yeah, in the summer I can just wear like bikini and then shorts and then that top and I'll be good to go. Um, and then lastly, I got this dress. A whole maxi dress and it kind of like has a slit here and the, I don't like how it's in the middle necessarily but I think it's so cute so it's like kind of like mini here and then it has the long that goes down all the way it's literally gorgeous and then the back but like, let's give it up for the back of the dress like she's like a whole open back moment um, also, it's like really good fabric, like it's really nice. Okay, that's all that I got from Zara. Moving on to Princess Polly, what I got. First thing, and I did get these a couple weeks ago, but I got it with summer, like last spring in mind, so I'm just including this in this haul. I got this top, which I really like, but I wish I got it in a size down because it's really stretchy, obviously, and the neckline kind of doesn't fit me right. I don't know. It's like it's fine, but I kind of wish I got it in a size down. It's a nice fabric. It's pink, which I love. I layer it under my like Urban Outfitters skeleton pink shirt, and I think that looks really cute. So that's the first thing I got. Okay, the second thing I got is this tank top, and Sadie actually got it, and I was like, oh my god, shit's cute. And and I love it. Third thing I got. Oh my god, I love these pants so much. Okay, so I got these pants. And they're literally so stunning. I don't know. I love the color blue now, like, clothing-wise. Pink is my favorite color. But blue, it just hits. I don't know, in clothes it hits different. But I used to hate blue because I was like, you can't wear jeans in blue. And I still believe that. If you're wearing blue jeans, you better not be wearing a blue shirt. I don't care but I like blue now. Anyways, okay, so this is it. A really thin fabric, which 
isn't great if you wanted like winter pants but I'm thinking of, like spring or like again I could wear this with a bikini on the beach um, and they're just like really light and flowy which if you're gonna wear pants in summer or spring is like a good a good thing okay then I got this skirt this is a skirt it's this most like the most gorgeous fabric I literally love it so much it's like satiny it feels really nice um, it has the slit in the side that's like the perfect length I love it and I'm really you'll see in this haul I'm really into maxi skirts and midi skirts right now because they're so flowy and you can like you don't I okay I love a good mini skirt but I don't want to have to wear my butt hanging out every five seconds um so yeah or coming and me being like oh my god it's too short I can only wear it in Instagram pictures so I think this is a good solution also I love them because they're so flowy and you can just you feel like you're ready to run through fields of flowers and I need those vibes um so yeah last thing I got this dress it's gorgeous like I literally love it oh my god it's so pretty okay so this is the top bit as you can like see the detailing it has like a ruffle detailing here which is really pretty the fabric is stunning it's green we all know how everyone's feeling about green it has this little tie in the middle which is really cute so yeah, I really like this. This the um straps are also adjustable, which is amazing. And it's the perfect length. It's the perfect length. Like you can walk around, run around, you don't have to worry about how like short it is or it feels nice. Oh my god, yeah. I'm in love, if you couldn't tell, I'm in love with this. So that's all the clothes that I got from retail stores now let's run to thrift stores also i just want to show you so this is all that i got from retail th retail stores zara was 177 pretty little thing or not pretty, princess polly was i think it was more like 130 so that's like 300 dollars. now again very professional i got all of these clothes from the thrift store Okay, that's from two stores. One store I spent a hundred and the other store I spent ninety-nine. That cost me two hundred dollars. It's literally four times the clothes, guys. And it cost me a third of the price. No, two thirds of the price. But yeah, anyways, okay. So first up is a thrift store I went to yesterday. I went to Zurich with Malvi and um yeah, so we went to Zurich. Had some fun in Zurich, whatever. It was really nice weather. Went clo went thrift shopping. Yeah. And um, it was super cheap. Oh my god, it was so cheap. Um, it wasn't an hour and a half away. Was it worth it? Honestly, I mean, yeah. Like, I don't really care. Like, I had a free day, so it doesn't really matter. But I'll put the location on the screen here if you guys want to go. I would suggest it had a huge clothing selection and everything was super cheap and like I mean like super cheap anyways okay so especially for Switzerland anyways okay so basically I have so much clothes on. to a compliment guys. Um you look nice. Thank you. You look nice. I need an emoji with the face. Like so bad because every time I type something I'm like, oh my god, I need to add at the end of it. And it's like the winky face doesn't work for that because the winky face is too serious. I feel like if we all as a group decide to use the winky face, 
ironically that it would work but we don't so I need like the emoji back to the haul first thing I got is this shirt which I'm going to look exactly how it is because I am obsessed okay it's this pink shirt right it's long it's huge like I love it um it's this brand I don't really know wait yeah I don't really know exactly what that is but the chest thingy is really pretty wait yeah that's really pretty and I love baby pink and it's oh my god the color guys it's actually stunning like it's actually so pretty okay then next thing I'm not like so tired okay Next thing I got is this skirt because all the girls on my Pinterest are wearing like this skirt and like a sweatshirt and a turtleneck or this skirt and like just the cutest fits. So I got this skirt. It's kind of, it's like, I need to take in the waist because the waist is a bit too big. But the bottom parts, the bottom parts, is, the bottom part fits me. But I'm taking the waist like two inches. But yeah, she's really cute. I love it. It's kind of brown. It's showing up as black, but it's kind of brown. Okay, so next I got this tank top, which is like the little lacy like moment that I feel like everyone's been, hello, been down for recently. It's really cute. It has like a little bow with a rhinestone in the middle, but it's kind of long, so I'm gonna crop it, I think. Yeah, crop it and then bring in the sides a little bit. But what's really fun is this part is like kind of mesh. It gets like see-through and wow, it's really cute. So that's that top. Next, I got this top. I'm gonna I'm gonna crop this one as well. Just wear the after where the last button is because I think the opening is kind of weird. But um yeah, it's really stunning. The cap sleeves are like magical. They kind of like wish I had cooler buttons, but that's okay. Now, this top, I'm so proud of myself because they had literally the same exact top at Zara. What is this? Baramata, okay. They had the same exact top at Zara for like 30 bucks and I found it at the thrift store the next day. So yeah, basically just this flowy pink top. It's like really thin. And like, yeah, it's beautiful. I love it. Um, the next thing I got is this top, which I'm also gonna crop. But it just looks like this, and I kind of like it. It's like preppy. I like the collar and the buttons. Um, it gives me like tennis. I probably wear it to tennis to be honest. With like a tennis skirt, I think it's really cute. I really like it. Okay, next thing I got is this skirt. And I'm going to keep it the same. Some things I bought, but I'm going to use for fabric. This skirt, I'm going to keep it all the same. But I'm just going to bring it in and make it shorter. So it's like a mini skirt for summer. Because this color is absolutely phenomenal. Like, and the fabric is so nice. Yeah, I think it's very cute. So I'll definitely be going to work on that one soon. Next is this top, which... It's from H&M actually, which doesn't really surprise me, but I love the print. It's kind of like old, I feel like this print is kind of out, but I don't know, I still like it. It's actually a bodysuit, so I'm definitely going to crop that part off and then bring it in a little bit because it is a little bit too big. But I feel like I could make some really cute outfits with this in the summer, so I'm excited about that. Next thing I got is this top which is actually also a bodysuit but i'm cutting that off basically okay i'm gonna insert a picture here of what i'm going to turn this into because this is scary i think i can turn it into that top and if i can that'll be very fun for me so okay so these pants i really need help with how to style them because i like them and they fit me perfectly that's the thing that's why i bought them so they literally fit me perfectly but, and they're like straight leg, they're really cute, but I don't know how to style them. I think they're really swag, but like, I don't know, I need to like figure out how I'm going to style them. Also this tag, like this company looks so cool. 
I look like really, like I really like it. I wonder, I don't know. But yeah, they're really cute, they're a nice material, but I don't know how I'm gonna style those. So let me know in the comments. They're kind of a weird green color. Like at first I thought they were kind of brown, but they're kind of like, you can, I mean the color comes up true on the camera, it's kind of a weird green. So that is the first stack of clothes. And I all got that from the second store. First thing, I'm so excited about this. It's this mesh top. Mm, it's this mesh sparkly top, so you can see it kind of has sequins all the way down. And yeah, I just, I really, really like it. And I don't love the collar. I like, but it's very pointy, as you can see. So I might just like, or make the corners a little bit less pointy. But other than that, I love it. This um, part at the bottom is kind of long, but I just folded it up and I styled it last night and this looks beautiful. So I think it's really cute. I yeah, I love that. Next thing I got is this top, which is also kind of like an army green, which I know like isn't in, but I kind of dig it. Yeah, I really like this one. Um, this completely ignore the shirt and just look at the pattern because I'm going to turn it into a tank top. Here's the shirt, but let's look at the fabric. I think I can make this into a really cute tank top. So we'll keep it tuned for that, hopefully. Orange was never my thing, but we'll see. Maybe I can make it my thing. I don't know. Okay, next top. I'm really into baby tees, but I haven't really been able to find any. And I found this one, and I was like, okay, she's cute. It's just this baby, it's just this top, but it fits really nice and tight on top. And then I'm going to crop it into a little baby tee. And I think it'll be really cute with any, like, kind of statement bottoms, but it's not white, so it'll still add some spice. Um, next thing I got are these pants. They're just these white kind of like, um, what is it called? Canvas. Like this, this canvas kind of f fabric. They're really long, wide leg. They have a little tie thing at the top and elastic in the back area and so they fit really well. And these are like totally a beach pant. Like, Oh my god, I'm so excited. Like, sunsets in the morning, and then you walk out to the beach, and you're wearing these pants. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. They're perfect. Okay, next thing I got is this. And it does give me a little bit sixth grade, but I'm kind of in love with it. Like, with Nikes and then a shit ton of necklaces and jewelry, I feel like it could, I could, it could be, uh, I feel like it could be really cute. The only thing I hate is it has this little neon green on the dress. Exactly. So I'm probably going to try and seam rip that out or do something to cover it because it's really, really, really bad. But I love this a lot. It's really cute. Um, yeah. So I'm excited to wear this in the summer. I think it will be nice. Okay. This, these pants are huge. They're absolutely stunning. Like... The color is fantastic. They have the pockets, have this little butterfly sparkle situation. I don't know. Yeah. And they're so pretty and it makes me very sad because they don't fit. And they don't fit to the point where I don't even think I could bring them in properly and they still will look okay. So I'm gonna use them. I'm gonna make a top out of them basically. I like a wrap top because the blue is so pretty and then I'm gonna try and see if I can salvage these perfect details. Yes? Tater, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my coffee. I totally forgot this was here. Last things I got from this stuff is all from the first thrift store. Um I'm including this but I'm altering it right now, so ignore the pins. But it's just this top. And I don't know, it's inside out right now, but whatever. It's just this like purple top, it's really cute. Um, I like it. I could have kind of worn it as like a flowy top, but it's a bit too small to be honest to wear it as like a flowy top over something, so I decided not to. It came with this skirt that I actually wore yesterday. I just brought it in three inches and it fits me perfectly. And it's this midi skirt. What did I say about midi skirt? Um, but yeah, it's this midi skirt, 
and it's really pretty. Again, it's the most beautiful fabric, and the way it's sewn, it just flows so well, and I'm literally in love with it. So that is already like, ooh, it's ready to wear. Beautiful. <sighs> Continuing. This top, again, ignore the top itself. I'm using it for the fabric because I think it would make a beautiful wrap top, like summer wrap top. I think it's beautiful. And so I'm going to make it into, into that. But yeah, I think it's really pretty. I love it, like, a lot. So, yeah. The next thing as well I'm just using for fabric. The second store, there were a lot of things. I'm going to leave in their same shape and just alter them so they fit me better. But the first store, there's more things that I kind of got for fabric. Or, like, making it into a tank top, which is fine because I have a whole Pinterest notes of, like, tops and stuff that I want to make. From Pinterest that I just like screenshot and I was like, like, girl, <laughs> I can make these myself. So, yeah. Um, I can do a, a recording of those here. Yeah, yeah. So, these green pants, which are showing up more green on screen, honestly. But these green pants, which I love, they're like the green color. Like, they're like neon green. And summer, it's that spring 2020, it's like... Not like it on neons, but like mixing bright colors, like, like just being like out of there with playing with color, which I think is amazing because I love colorful clothes. Um, there are some days where I will pop out in an all black outfit like this, and she just popped off. Like I felt so amazing. Like the reason I'm, I'm not gonna get into this. What am I doing? But the reason I love clothes is because they make you feel. so so confident if you find the right pair of clothes and you put them together you feel amazing like it doesn't matter who you are like you feel fantastic and this outfit like did that for me but it's all black but I just I felt like Taylor Swift from Reputation like I just felt amazing so but I also love 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 color which I think is what we're getting from this whole thing because all the stuff that I bought from the thrift store is like bam and um Stuff I brought by bought from Zara and Princess Polly as well. The green dress, the blue, the red, the bright pink. Like, I just love color. So, yeah. But I think, honestly, I have enough fabric here to make this into a two-piece set. Even though I already have a green skirt that I'm altering. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm definitely going to have more fabric than just making a top with this. So, we'll see where that goes. But I really love these pants. Again, honestly, I wear them as pants if they weren't huge. Like, they're so iconic. Um, Gloria Queen, I know you hate colored pants, but I just cannot vibe with that, so I'm just gonna ignore that fact. Um, next thing I got is the most beautiful top I have ever seen. It's crafted, like, the craftsmanship that went into this top is unspeakable. Like, it's breathtakingly gorgeous. It's so pretty. <laughs> It's probably one of my favorite things that I got. I think it's just such a, like, a rare find. I love talking about this while I'm like, buttoning up the buttons and you can't even see the top and I'm just like, trust me, your eyes are going to be blessed. Anyways, they are. So, it's this top, which is just, oh my gosh. Okay, it's the perfect pink color. Like, it's the perfect blush pink color. Then, let's talk about, okay, the collar first. The collar. It's like this frilly little moment. It's so cute. I'm in love. But then we have this detail. Oh my god, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. Okay, then we had the sleeves. They're gorgeous, guys. They're literally so gorgeous. This comes down to a little like scalloped edge right here. And then we have this little embroidered bit as well that matches the part by the top. But I think. It's just, oh my god, it's gorgeous, guys. Like, it's literally gorgeous. Okay, moving on. Next thing I got. Next thing I got are these. If you couldn't tell, I love the color pink. But I already said that. So, I got these pants. Which, I'm kind of been obsessed with the whole, like, ignore the bottoms. Because I've been obsessed with the whole, like, girls wearing boxer shorts. Thing. These pants. Um, I'm just gonna bring in the waist and then cut them so they look like boxer shorts and then do something else with the rest of this fabric because yeah we don't want to be wasteful here 
I feel like it'd be good for a top because it's a really flowy, like, nice fabric. Um, the next thing I got, I have, okay, I have two more things. This is kind of the last, like, shirt, to be honest. <laughs> well, not to be honest, it is. So, I got this mesh top, and I think it's gorgeous. It gives me 80s vibes, but it's also, like, classy, like, I love it. And I think it's going to be perfect to just wear on top of things in the summer. You see, it's a really pretty print, and it just has white buttons. So, I think it's going to be really cute to spice up some outfits in the summer, and it's really light, so it'll be nice. So, I want to make this maxi skirt. Basically, kind of, this one. And, so, I got this giant pink bed sheet. Because... Because, here's the thing, I live in Switzerland, right? So, I go to a fabric store, I get two yards of fabric, I didn't do this, I'm saying, as a kit scenario. I go to the fabric store, I get two yards of fabric to make a skirt, and it cost me five times this. Like, it would cost me so much more to do that. So, what I said, scour thrift stores for bed sheets. I don't know what's so wrong with that, anyways. Um, this was four francs. If you're telling me I can make a maxi skirt, uh, wrap top, tank tops, out of this, like, let's see, I can probably make three items out of this fabric. For four francs? Shut up. Shut up, Bestie, shut up, because that is a steal and you know it. Okay, anyways, I'm just so happy with that for myself. But anyways, yeah, it's just this huge pink bed sheet, and I'm gonna make a maxi skirt out of it. That's my, like, one of my goals for my thrift flips bed sheet into a dress. Ha ha, jokes. Um, I was trying to find a pretty pattern one, but I couldn't really find any, so I kind of got the pink one. I opened it up here. Um, I got two books and a bag. So I got this book, which I, y'all, okay, I know it's going to sound weird and pretentious, but I am in a reading phase. Um, I read, I, I'm not actually here, I just put a book, oh, the bookmark in it. I read um, another book by this author. And I really loved it. I would totally recommend. It's called Wilder Girls. I don't know if you've heard of it because it's been all over TikTok. So if you are on Book Talk or go on YouTube and like search for books, like young adult books, then it definitely would have come up for you already. But I would definitely recommend it. It's really, really good. Um, I'm supposed to be reading The Crucible for school. I think it's pretty clear I'm not going to be doing that. But yeah, like that was the other book that I read. I don't know if it's going to go into focus. I got this book, which is kind of cool. Um, I don't really know what it's about, to be honest. Um, I read the the thing on it online, because I, I have a notes full of books I want to read. I can put it here, too, if you want to see. It's like 30 bucks. Um, and then after I finish with them, I have a note of books <laughs> that I finished in my review of them as well. So... Yeah, so this is all my book that I wanted to read, and so was this one. And everyone was telling me it was really good. It's all over TikTok and YouTube again, so I really want to read it. I'm, I don't know if I'm going to read first. Co actually, don't comment down below because, actually do, because I'm going to edit this video in two days. That's my goal, and it's going to happen. So, books. Yeah. So comment down below if you want to read first. This thing I got is this bag okay i was supposed to get it for christmas but we got it from etsy and shipping's backed up everywhere i think because covid and it was christmas so i got this bag oh my god so obviously it's harry Styles' moth tattoo okay so let's just start there it's harry Styles' moth tattoo it's beautiful um it's this canvas fabric which is really beautiful it's like the perfect size because it's not huge, but it's like not small, but it's definitely big enough for like, oh my god, let me go to the park and bring my laptop and a book and study. I'm cutting that out. Uh, yeah, but I think I just want to be one of the tote bag girls, but I can't keep a single plant alive, so I don't know if that's really my vibe. Anyways, that was it. Thank you for watching this video. Um, I think it'll be a little boring to watch right now. So hopefully the try-ons are a bit more interesting. But yeah, that's it. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed and had a good time watching this. Bye guys. Bye besties. Love you the most.